All right, so today I'm getting my cameraman to come through and make a beat with me. He's never used FL Studio before, but this is mainly going to be on him. I don't want to interrupt too much. I just want to see if he can actually, you know, make something cool for me. Today I thought why not make a new video on how to make beats for absolute FL Studio. Why are you watching my videos? This guy knows what he's talking about. I don't think you do. Both of our tea. Englishman. Uh, this is. is the man behind the last performance video, the sample collection video that I just dropped like last week. And now he's got a proper challenge on his hands because he's good with the video stuff, but music stuff. Nope. What are you thinking of making? I don't have a clue what I'm doing, mate. I need you to make me just, a fire melody. Just a fire melody. Yeah, okay. Basically. I like my melodies quite <laughs> vibey. Okay, space heart. <laughs> That's really vibey. I want to make like a sinister type beat, you know. How are you structuring the creation of the melody? Do I need to follow like the industry standard of making chords or can I just kind of like try and get something that sounds cool? Just put the five in the key. For example, what I just did there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's, it's not gonna fly, is it? It's probably best to click it in. I've set it to E minor. You see like all the highlighted, all the ones that aren't dark blue. Mm -hmm. Basically anything in there will, should sound good. So, um, let's go with this one. A little bit something there. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. I'm looking for. With this, I want to get a really. I want a hard drop, but I'm going to be honest, I have no clue where to go with it now. Like, that's normally good for a bar, and then I'll just repeat it and maybe add a little bit of like. Add a little variation. bit. A bit more to it. So, where, where do I find the bass then? <laughs> I don't know, why is, it, why is it still playing? Why is it still playing? Why are you running? Because you were super low on it. You want to do that? Yeah, I think it sounds a bit odd to me because we haven't got anything else on it. You're on good tracks right now. I reckon that's good for an intro. Now we can do like the B part where the drums will be in and everything. You say you always start on E. For this, I'd probably, yeah, probably start on E. <laughs> I don't have a clue what I'm doing with this. <laughs> so yeah, I had a, an idea for what I wanted for the, the intro, but when it comes to this bit here, I don't have a vision. I need to help. A little bit, yeah. I think it may be just something dead simple, just like an E chord, and we'll just like arpeggio it. I have no idea what that means. Ooh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kung Fu fighting. <laughs> and that could be a loop. Yeah. Ooh. I like those keys though, at the top. I like that, bro. I thought it Should we splice that shit up? Splice. <laughs> <laughs> Just throw around the words and I don't know what I'm talking about. On the right, where the slots are, click on the empty space. We'll go with some reverb first. Valhalla. Valhalla, I like that. Oh, I know a fun one you can use actually. Press the looper right there, and now you can just do what you want with this. Ooh, what's that? I think it sounds decent. Yeah. Yeah. With it. Let's go with that. Are you going to work your magic on it now? You can flip it. It's going to reverse it. See what it sounds like. Is it odd for you to reverse an 808? You can do that. No, no, you can do that actually. You can try that. Yeah, yeah. It's not as like intrusive. Have you got the reverse on that? Yeah, yeah. So it's a reverse and a normal 808 together? Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Um. <laughs> I don't 
don't know what else to add to this. <laughs> you got any ideas? No. <laughs> I don't know what to do with the rest of this. I need that hard drop in there, bro. Off. That was the drop. You did the drop. Play it from the beginning. Sounds like a different song. <laughs> actually, that sounds nice. That first melody you did was actually hard. That's catchy. Could we do something like interesting? <laughs> so, can we do something more interesting? <laughs> so, hear me out. We've got this. Blah, blah, blah. It plays along. Beat keeps going. Beat keeps going. And then can it could it like kick back in there? Just catch the listener off guard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I got you. I got you. We're pulling it back. Can we have like some sound effect in there that shows the change in the song and like some sort of like? <laughs> ah, just simple one. And what we could do, I think the problem, the thing that I'm hearing is because it, it doesn't sound like nothing's changing. Thing right here. So this. Mm. And with yeah, the. Yeah, 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 I like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's okay. What do you think? I think it's all right, mate. I think it's decent for, for my first time. It's not something I'd hear on the radio. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've got, maybe we've got a ways to go until I become a producer, but as a first beat, I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, I think it's pretty good, man. Sound selection was sick, to be fair. Like, that synth sounds kind of crazy. Yeah. yeah, you got there, man. But you guys let us know what you thought of this beat. But yeah, other than that, have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.